But look, there's like literal animals on here. I'm literally just gonna load it just so I can just get a point. There's a mule deer running by. There's also all these bison up here. Okay. I want to try and spot all of them. change my loadout real quick. Um, moose and bear would probably fit. This is literally just for money. Almost out of 300 ammo. Alright, well. There's a bison. River. Really? I am gonna have to change this to a full screen. Because I keep accidentally clicking off the screen. Who's that? Oh, there's a turkey! Let's see if I can do it. Nope! Nope! Why? Oh, wait! You turned! Come back! Wait! Are you gonna land? Oh, you have friends! Oh, so close. Oh my goodness, so close. Oh, I hit that one and flopped it over immediately. Those guys have run. Well, well. Get there. Once we get kind of close to it, I'll just send the dog after it. This was not where I planned to hunt today. It's just that when I loaded in, since I could see the animals straight up from just the main menu, I was like, ooh, that's kind of cool. It's pretty rare for me to actually see animals from there, but like, I know that you can. This is, this is not where I plan to hunt today, though. Now we have the dog with us, as you could tell. Her name is Zara, after my own chocolate lab in real life. Um, level 10 companion, level 7 as a retriever. We're gonna praise her a couple times. Get her to heal. Praise her again. And as we get closer, I'm gonna send her out to retrieve. <laughs> She's definitely got a different bark than my own lab does. <laughs> my lab has a much uh, bigger bark for her side. We'll let her bring us these turkeys. Oh. Oh. Now, I think the reason she didn't grab the second one is because it was farther than it could be when I sent her out originally. I want to get one of you guys like art. Oh, 
or the face. Four times, though. See, now she's brought back two turkeys and she's already registering as tired. But we also only started off as alert. For three million meter shots. Waypoint, just because it kind of annoys me when I forget. But yep, our little chocolate lab hanging out with us. I think it's kind of funny that as she walks and like runs next to us in the kill pose, she uh <laughs> like kind of runs with her head like down, like looking at the ground right in front of her instead of like up, forward, and outwards. Nah, uh, who cares? Cute. Oop, hi. All right, let's see. Left scapula, flesh, lung brain. Got it. Definitely. The lab is, I think, very sweet, very cute. You can still, same as always, play pet, all of this stuff. I don't have treats on me, which is kind of unfortunate, but we are going to head to the map that I intended to record this video on now, and uh, <laughs> we'll probably run into some more birds than just a handful of turkeys on a hillside 400 meters away. Now this is the map I meant to be on. Revan Thule. I'm not necessarily going to be going after anything waterfowl. I'm just going to kind of be running this road here on the southern island just to see what kind of upland birds I can run into because when exploring the map I definitely ran into quite a few <clears throat> so that's the goal we're just gonna run along see what we can run into I might get a couple of geese or something just as they fly over I don't expect to but I do expect to run into some upland birds so I will check back in if and when ideally when that happens That's a little too big. Definitely got that one. I also want to give her a chance to catch up. Female by color. All right. I'm really glad that she's fairly fast. And I can't imagine like how much faster they would need to be. See another one. I don't think I got that one. Ooh, look at her go. She's just having a grand old time. Oh, that's like a dust thing. There she is with one. Female, 694. I don't think we got the second one. No. <clears throat> Maybe as we go further along, we will. I'm getting so distracted. All right, first of all, I love that. But I don't think I'm going to want to keep going with the time that I have. So I'm probably going to go back here. Change the time back to like eh, 8 a.m. or so. That way I have plenty of light. Rehead back down that road and we'll just see what we can get. But I'm definitely going to need to change the time. I think I saw the rabbit. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, it wasn't even a rabbit. Was it? Oh, it was. We got it with one single pellet. Cool.
Listen, I know it's buckshot. Or not buckshot, birdshot. I'm aware. No, they cannot retrieve these guys. These are not class one. The only thing they can retrieve is class one animals. If I asked her to retrieve that link, she would run up past it, up until her max distance, and then come running back saying nothing to retrieve. Alright, go get it. See anything else? Some ducks. Oh. A molting male. Alright, onward. I'll tell you one thing that I did notice in the transference of uh console to PC. There's a huge speed difference in what I can do when tracking an animal like this compared to what I can do when I was on console. Like, you couldn't make movements like this aiming down the sights. Because you were locked at that one smooth speed that the controller had. Like, sure, you could increase the sensitivity of it. But it was rough. This one I at least see. That time I could send her after more than one. Move to the road. Like 67. Female. Oh, it's the end of the tree. Not too bad. Another female. You get to treat. Now you'll notice I'm definitely getting the birds. <laughs> it's less than I anticipated somehow, but it's still plenty. But I think we're going to try and pull up the the beta because I've definitely gotten some of these done. Alright, we'll bring back out our shotgun and keep going. Forgot to ask the dog to heal. <laughs> I just left it sit there on stay. Nope, sorry, you stay there. There you are. You caught up pretty fast. But I definitely think I'm going to enjoy upland bird hunting with the Labrador way more than I am waterfowl hunting. But I think that's just personal taste. Because honestly, I really miss the old um, pre-waterfowl rework hunting for geese specifically. Like, I think the old geese system would have been absolutely incredible with the Labrador. I understand why they decided to make the waterfowl rework happen the way that they did. I understand the realism. I totally do. Like, I just had more fun with the old geese system. And I think it's because I didn't come to play Call of the Wild, you know, for realism. If I want realism, I usually play classic. 
honestly. And like that's what they advertise classic as is as their most realistic hunting game or the most realistic hunting game even. Like that's what I play classic for. I play Call of the Wild so I can shoot animals. <laughs> you know? Like that's what I'm in here for. I am in here to shoot animals. Classic, I play to hunt. I thought that might have been the outpost that I wanted to turn at, but it's not. But once I get to that outpost, I'm actually going to go sit in that spot that I have set up there because that is actually, I believe, for Goldeneye. Yep, it sure is. So we're going to go up there. We're going to set up for Goldeneye. We're going to get, hopefully, a few of them at least. And uh, we'll send Zara out into the water. I know they're all going to be grounded, which I get. And that's fine. I'm going to send her to retrieve all of it. We're going to stand right over here. is perfect. We're right at the entrance to this, and that's where I wanted to be. These guys are all grounded, which I understand completely. she drops one off. I don't know if it's after she's done bringing all of them back. Don't know. Oh. Almost level 10. Level 10. She's not done yet. We're gonna... I'm gonna do the recycle arrows. Because I think that's a really cool perk. <laughs> I bow hunt a lot. Now we're gonna head not to the outpost necessarily. This is just an easier way for me to get to the shore. We're going to head to my waterfall find setup. And we're gonna go get some golden eye and probably be sending Zara out into the water just to test and see how that goes. My golden eye setup is just a little ways down this shoreline. might have gotten three. Oh yeah, she brings them right to me. This is great. I don't even have to get out to, you know, go claim them. Like, if you're in a tripod, you gotta get out. <clears throat> I'm assuming... If you were in, like, a tree stand, you'd have to get out. But yeah, no, these, she's like, oh yeah, here you go. Have a duck. Have another duck. 
Just happy as can be. Look at her go. <laughs> I get a little shake off. They're at least still calm, which is great. So I'm gonna wait till these guys come out of the trees, I think. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she just like jumps straight at the blind somehow. <laughs> that was hilarious. Oh yes, land right there on the shoreline where I can see. Watch her jump right in the water or something. Thanks. I can't believe she launched herself from the shore at me. That was pretty funny. I might see if she'll lay down here soon. Oh no, she's gonna go get that one. These guys are not breaking flock, it looks like. Oh, I missed a duck that she brought to me. Drive by duck drop off! I'm gonna have her lay down for a minute before she gets too tired. Or just launch yourself back into the water. <laughs> so much energy. This will be the last duck I think I send her after. So the consensus has been duck hunting is great, but I think upland hunting is where it's gonna be at. At least for me. Hi. <clears throat> you did great. Stuck in a tree, but you did great. Oh no. I tried. Alright, well. <laughs> We tried. Uh, we did our best. We got, you know, a good amount of upland birds, a good amount of ducks. I'm pretty satisfied with that. We even had a gold, golden eye. I think that is a pretty good ending. Do a pretty good hunt with these guys. I mean, I didn't get nothing super special, but I mean, I had a great time. Oh, and right here at the end, we actually ended up getting level 15 with her. And so this next trick, I'm not going to do the wolf howl. I'm going to do the dog will run further away. That'll be my level 15 trait. Oh, and level 20, apparently. Um... I think I like control. So yeah, I guess we hit level 20 and... Oh, it's the companion level. Why did I think it was the retriever level? Oh. Okay, well, I guess we're at level 20 for Zara. Um... <coughs> Kind of messed that up, but he's just uh, chilling up here on the hill, <laughs> taking a nap. Oh, there's an animal right there. <laughs> I 
Not me having a whole little photo moment over here and there's straight up a raccoon dog just sitting here that I forgot to pick up. There's another one over there letting go with some mating calls. All right, well. I think we're gonna wrap up here. It's a good spot to wrap up. Alrighty, well, I had a great time, so. Do everybody. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. I appreciate you all for hanging out with me. And I will see you next time. Bye.